Dr. Naj? Yes, thank you so much. Um, so I just wanted to say that I really am thrilled that you guys all came here from so far away to make this statement, and thank God it's recorded. So forevermore, the rest of the country will be able to see these videos. Um, and I wanted to mention building biologists. Uh, they are people who should have been speaking today, maybe next, next time. And they measure EMF and chemicals and mold in the home. And the American Academy of Environmental Medicine, which has written policy on the medical consequences of EMF exposure. And that in my practice, we see, as well as with Dr. William Ray in Dallas, that mold exposure is the leading cause of damage to the membranes, the voltage-gated calcium channels, that then makes people electrohypersensitive. So um, we should all be working together in this area because some people know about EMF, some people know about mold, some people know about building, some people know about government agency policy, which is slow to change. And the idea is that by being invited to these types of meetings and being allowed to participate, we will be able to enhance education nationally. Thanks so much. Wonderful, Lisa.